Gamers, we're back at it with Neo World and with you. The latest entry in the series, and it's fabulous. The music, of course, is fabulous. And we're currently looking for Ryoji's little helper. That's not a euphemism, it's an actual thing. Yes, that's what he referred to, or referred this person as. It's this person? No. Just a pretty Lindo. boy. Don't think we'd see him again, okay. so, so. Can we scan him? Can we? Please? Already? I admit it didn't occur to me to read the thoughts of celebrities. Why does she look like that? Kind of feels like a violation of privacy. Glad I'm not the one getting rid. Hmm. So this, this lovely last up at the top left is my newest party member. She hasn't yet fought with us? Social work has been updated. You know. So the social network is something different. You can actually now... Mm, where is that? Yeah, you can actually now claim rewards from people by spending friend points. So you'll, uh, the people you meet, if they're important to the story, they'll be added to your social network and you can use friend points, which are earned from doing various tasks for them, to unlock a variety of useful things for yourself, such as if I un upgraded her right now, Nagi, you get a, an option to retry a battle instead of having to start all the way over. So that's pretty useful. Um, there's also threads. I wish they'd show up on the character model, but you know, barring that, it's fine. And I'm just happy that I guess I got this for pre-ordering the legendary Hagram hey Neku's outfit. So I equipped it to Rindo, but different outfits have different um, bonuses based on the character. That's what I've been equipping them based on. I like how you can equip Nagi, but she doesn't actually fight with you. And then Mini M Mimoto. He's got such a name. Minami Moto. He's actually from the first game. I didn't recognize him. They changed his character look a little bit. He didn't look as... Um... Oh, she is on my team now. Sweet. Um, he didn't look as, as fearsome and kind of sketchy as he did before, but yeah, he's one of the main characters. So this is not his first rodeo. How unfortunate. Anyway, we're looking for Ryoji's little helper. I don't know why that's uh, in the center street alley. Thank you. We're looking for a little helper in an alley. That doesn't sound at all strange. So here we are on center street. Might there be a confrontation with the noise awaiting us? Pretty sure. Let's sweat Nagi. I don't believe I was speaking to you. She could be okay. So Nagi does not like um, Fret for whatever reason. I mean, obviously it's because he's kind of a clown, but you know, let's give her a try. I don't know what kind of pin she has on her. Almost got a full party. I believe there's one more character we're missing. It's a bear. Yeah, I've, uh, I've beat a, a couple of bosses in the, in the interim since the last time you saw me. And I'm currently just um, trying to get new pins, trying to master the ones I have. Because that's the name of the game. Once you master them, they can sometimes evolve, or they'll even. Or rather, you can master them, and sometimes they'll evolve. Not all of them have that ability. And when they evolve, they kind of remain the same as far as input goes, like uh, Minami Moto's currently got like a punch going on, so when it upgrades it'll still be a punch motion, but it'll be more powerful. It's a good thing to upgrade where you can. And also, you know, I was lucky the first time I played, so I wasn't, I wasn't paying much mind to like the combos and Get a lot better. You can actually use multiple attacks at once and just like switch between characters. And that's the whole point of fighting. There you go. And that's the whole point of fighting with the team of four is you're not supposed to use the button until it goes on cooldown. You're supposed to switch enough so that yeah, see that one didn't evolve. You're supposed to switch enough so that you can constantly keep up that flow of attacks. So let's change his pin. I don't think I have another one that I haven't mastered. Do I? Cold, cold Coney. I believe I did that one. 
Angela Kick, Master. Okay, so this is the only one. A bunny rabbit looking thing. Nico is working, if you can believe that. Oops. Kawaii. We've also unlocked the ability to visit shops, so now I can get equipment, just the clothes for my characters, and buy food. Food is the way you raise your stats as opposed to in battle. Um, when you level up, this game is so visually pleasing, isn't it though? Kudos to you, Square Enix. I mean, they tend to have fantastic art and character design, I will say. I'm a little biased. He does say. But, um... What was I saying? Right, so leveling up from combat only raises your HP. Everything else is raised by your equipment, which you can buy in stores, and also by eating. Um, characters have preference in food, so sometimes that'll affect whether or not you get a, a bonus in... Oh, here we go. I'm, hmm. I am literally in an alleyway looking for a random guy. It seems safe. It seems good. Who this? Um, he's red. Is this our guy? Ryoji's little helper? Something definitely feels off about him. This makes me want a Jet Set Radio remake for the PS4. Yeah. They have something similar to Jet Set. Wait, there is a remake of Jet Set Radio. I don't know if it's PS4, it might be PS3. Something definitely feels off about him. Man, I've had it up to here with Ryoji. I know I should just turn off my brain and do whatever he asks, but this is ridiculous. What are these puzzles even for? Why do I have to be the one to set them up? Plus, it wouldn't kill him to show a little appreciation every once in a while. Arg! Just thinking about it pisses me off. Right? He's mad. The diatribe left little room for doubt. I am certain this is him. Yeesh, bit of a downer, isn't he? Like, lighten up, dude. It's only a job. I think it's gonna take a little more than chill out. <laughs> the air about him indicates some evil is at work within. What? I've entered the minds of many others, including some similar to this individual. Yeah, her psych is being able to actually enter your mind, so... And I'll, I'll probably run into using it again. When I first met her, I actually got the power to turn back time, so that's kinda cool. I'm gonna use that to solve puzzles from here on out. Something sinister. Tis not dissimilar to the noise. She also speaks like a medieval grain merchant? Not sure. Bomb Rush Cyberpunk is a spiritual successor to JSR, coming in 2022. Well, uh, hold on to that date. It might get pushed back, considering all the craziness. Hang on. Uh, leave, N leave Nagi alone, Nico. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. <clears throat> excuse me. Oi. Could that be the noise problem Susukichi was talking about? That's his last name? Ryuji Susukichi? Catchy. Oh, dang. Maybe. But is that something we can help with? Considering what Nagi did in my mind yesterday. Womp womp. And the fact she can hold her always against the noise. What if we had Naki use her powers? Thank you, dear. If she can get into his mind, maybe she can erase the noise that's taken root. Intriguing. I would be doing this alone. Why does she look like she's salivating? <laughs> Not if you sync up first. Minamimoto! Balance the equations of your bodies and minds, and your power will increase exponentially. <laughs> Now this, she looks so so dreamy-eyed because he uh, resembles one of the characters in a, a romance game she's playing, so <laughs> she fawns over him every now and again. It's hilarious. Your point of view might even converge, which means what? That you zeptograms have a chance to create a multiplicative function. I hate the way he talks. I've always hated math. <laughs> Otherwise, you're stuck playing with those third-rate reapers, and who knows what that would entail. Now there's a variable I'd love to solve for. What? <sighs> I don't know how to you, to make a multiple funk town or whatever, so maybe we should just get back to the mission? I don't know. I guess we can try syncing up, oh, no, was no. it? Hey Nagi, how do you get into people's minds? Well, I first perform an initial observation of my intended target. So you scan them? Then a portal into their mind appears before me. Interesting. At which point I simply let myself in. I can't blame her though. Why? Because he's cute, Grim. Almost sounds like breaking and entering. What if we both scanned at the same time? I wonder if that counts as syncing up. You'll also notice Minami Moto never describes or explains anything. He just says some shit and then is like, bye. That said, I must <laughs> warn you, people's minds are not a pleasant place to be. Agreed. Yeah, and having someone bars into your brain isn't great either. <laughs> 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 Dive on in there, my nugget girl. Dive on in. Like jumping into a pool. A big brain pool. Right. Just like that. Alright, so now I should have the ability. Ta-da! Diving with Nagi! 
Now you can enter people's minds and peer into their thoughts and exercise the noise that haunts them. Press the X button near a possessed person to dive inside their mind. Depending on your performance, you can earn multiple perform or multiple rewards as long as your difficulty is set to higher or normal. I'm going to save. I'm currently on normal difficulty. I think I can bump it up to hard difficulty. I haven't done so yet. The difference between difficulties being that you also you actually get more rewards, so it's worth it. Alright, let's dive. Recommended level 9. I'm 12. Look at this. It's an actual dive. And she does like a Naruto hand single. Fun. I love Japanese words that aren't actually Japanese words, just like a an accent on an English phrase. Look at its face! Increased damage. Oh, I see. Interesting. So yeah, you can switch between characters and actually like load up or charge up an attack while you're punching another one. Boom! That was too easy. I'm three levels ahead. It helps. I've been stuffing them so soon. Okay, waves. I got you. Reduction number two. Oh. We got another one. Now, when you fight in waves like this, you can actually do it on the main screen too. Um, the the chance of getting a drop of pins increases, so it's worth stacking fights as long as you know you can handle it, you know? So far I've got 11 buttons from this. Oh, it went down to silver! Damn! That was almost a gold. No, it's a bronze. No, that's four bronze, okay, and then silver afterwards, more front points. Oh, I kinda wanna do it again, I was close. Is there a dub for this? Have you heard it? Yeah, and it's bad. <laughs> I don't like dubs, Nico. There we go. Well, I exercised his demons. Maybe I should strike it on my own. I don't need Ryoji. In fact, I never needed him. I knew he'd have trouble the moment he made me solve a bunch of riddles just to get his number. Oh, I would have just given up that point. I suddenly feel like all my worries have just disappeared. Gee, I wish it was that simple. Yeah, forget this stupid job. I'm out. Time to treat myself to a nice meal. Faceless. What? what? Hmm, I think he dropped something. Literals will be persecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Okay, not good. <laughs> but wait, what have we here? Is it a pin? It's a letter. The only English dub I've enjoyed is the Hellsing series. Thank you, Grim. Trader Ryoji, handyman for hire. Appears to be a flyer advertising his services. Disney. Yeah. No job turned down, no matter the size or complexity. Okay, you have that on a banner, dude, and then you complain about the jobs you get? Come on now. Serious inquiries only. New clients will be vetted. If interested, call via the phone booth by Tower Records. What? Why that specific? What? Oh. Are phone booths still a thing? I've never used one. <coughs> Me neither. A number can be found by solving the puzzle scattered throughout Shibuya. Question one. Sinful Ramen. Question 2. Backstreet Refreshments. That sounds sketchy. Question 3. A hole in the crossing. Question 4. A dog's backside? Question 5. I'm gonna assume that's a statue. Question 5. A yellow building's entrance. Question 6. A haven covered in green. Okay, so I have to find these locations. So we have to solve his puzzles to prove ourselves to him, I guess? Mm. Strikes me as overly cautious to put prospective customers through such trials, right? Seriously, I don't think it'd be such a pain in the ass just trying to meet him. For real. Well, at least they're getting somewhere thanks to Nagi's sweet mind diving. <laughs> but man, that was one heck of a trip. Is it always so volatile? More or less. It works, though. It's Nagi's true power. It's not even her final form. A lot different from ours, that's for sure. 
I'm telling you, this swallow person, because they can't talk to people who are alive, so they have to be part of this game in some shape or form. We're gonna meet them and they're gonna be like a final boss or some shit. Rin Dragon, busy day yesterday? Yeah, kinda. Dealing with a newcomer. Oh, that's always exciting. I guess. You don't sound excited though. This is just my internet face. Her special ability is really great, but she's kind of weird. I'm not really sure what to make of her. It's part of the new game you're playing, right? Is your party already full? Can't hurt to keep them on board if you got room. Plus, special abilities are always good to have. Yeah, maybe you're right. I should give her a chance. Track down those digits, Rin dude. Right. Man, should I redo that? Oh, Shogun Void. Cast a chain at your target. High chance of chaining enemy struck. That was quite an exhilarating experience. Dang, that girl, look at you wiping out the noise. I don't believe I was speaking to you. <laughs> she does not like it. Um, yeah, 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 I finished that. Help AG over. Oh, I should have done that. I'll go do that. And then something. Okay, these are all the missions I can do today. I'm not gonna do the main one. I'm gonna go take care of these things because I'm sure they're time sensitive. Looks like he can use this one. Shogun Void. And he's also got Tiger Pumps. Healing Aura. I might be useful at some point. Who else mastered something? Look at you. Yeah, that's mastered. Okay, so she can do Cold Coney. That's mastered. Great Magma Escape. Alright, why not? Mm, this is three out of three. Eh, I don't have another pin for him. I guess I should go get her clothes. They're a little expensive. But, um, I have just a hat. Better than nothing. Let me go hit up the shop. Because currently I have 820 yen to my name, which is not phenomenal. But you yeah, can same. sell pins, of course. So any of the extras, and you do get quite a few extras. And then there are pins that are just for the sake of selling, like this 50 yen pin, instead of dropping money, 500 yen pin. But those you can sell without any sort of thought to it. But I typically sell the doubles that I have, and if I've already mastered it, I just sell whatever's on whatever's in my inventory currently. Because I have eight of these and I've already mastered, so no point in holding on to them. There's no benefit from mastering them multiple times. So there, we've got a little bit of scratch now. You'll notice that these are pretty expensive. HP boost. So I'm looking to buy for her. Let's get her a tight denim skirt. High top sneakers. Again, it'd be cool if you could actually see these on the character, because they sound like, you know, stuff? actual clothing. Just regular clothing you'd see on a on a person. So yeah. skirt and shoes. I didn't get an accessory, but that's okay. And then there's restaurants over here I can go to. That's gonna bug the shit out of me. I kinda wanna redo that fight. What's happening? Hmm. <sighs> Feels like we're taking a pretty big gamble here. You sure it's okay for us to just do whatever we want like this? Like you said, right now we're getting swept, and desperate times call for desperate measures. So if this will get us help us get ahead, then why not? Assuming that it does, in fact, help us get ahead. <sighs> but one cannot deny it remains a rather risky endeavor. Says a risky endeavor herself. <laughs> yeah, she can hold her own battle, but she's no Minamimoto. Yeah, diving into people's mind is pretty impressive and all, but still. I just... I don't know. Does something trouble you, Lord Rindo? You appear vexed. Me? No, I'm good. She didn't hear me think just now, did she? Very well then. Yeah, she can read minds. Maybe stop thinking about how weird she is. I got a question for you, boss. <sighs> Permit me to ask a question in return, boss. Yeah, because you're older than us and because you look down those noise like a boss took down those noise. But if you're our boss, does that mean you can fire us? Do you wish to tempt fate? <laughs> Guess I'd better stay on my best behavior then. Fred, what does that look like? So question, what brings you to the UG, boss? Crazy taxi collision? Sudden lung explosion? <laughs> I do not know this UG of which you speak. Uh, where we are right now? You know, the afterlife? The afterlife? As in, afterlife? As in, no longer among the living? Yep, dead, departed, kaput. Even I? Yep, apparently we all died somewhere and then got here to play this game. That sounds like hell. That would explain the unshakable feeling that I've been cast out of humanity. 
So in other words, I'm dead. Yeah, that's uh, that's the shorthand version. Oh, now she's depressed. Hey, I get it. It's a lot to take in. I know it sounds crazy, but think about it. We can't communicate with anyone but each other. And I don't feel very alive, so it just makes sense. <laughs> Sigh. I left my life behind of nothing to show for it save this wretched pin. <laughs> what pin? Wait, pin? What kind of pin? A rather nondescript one. It failed to pique my interest until Lord Tomonami's voice actor sang its praises. Granted, a few other Ellis Straniacs mentioned falling on hard times after picking up pins of their own. But who was I to question his ratings as commercial endorsement? Huh, I got the same ones. Do you think they're part of the game? Maybe you can quit if you just throw them away. Yeah, that doesn't sound like a good idea. <laughs> Giving up so Whoa. soon. Oh, oh, wah! Oh, this guy. Go on, pitch him and see what happens. Yeah. He is the embodiment of creepy Japanese man. Look at that face! Why don't you just tell us? Here's what I will tell you, kid. As an OG sum. These pins you've got are special. They're your player IDs. Player IDs? That's my uh my current uh avatar. Yeah. But everyone had them. These things are all over Shibuya. <laughs> and who do you think put them there in the first place? Normally we give them out when people die, but if everyone's already got them, it saves us the work later on. Oh, okay. Preemptive strike. So when they die, they're just transported here. And when they do kick the bucket, they can jump right into the game. Pretty slick, eh? Kind of scummy, actually. Wow, that's one hell of a marketing campaign. So you can go ahead and try throwing them away if you want. But you know what happens when you force quit in the middle of a game, don't you? You lose your save data? Your data gets corrupted, even erased entirely sometimes. Oh god, he's speaking my language. My worst nightmare. Nagi, you, you're, you're okay. What if you start bugging out? What if you lose all your powers? You'd be helpless against the hordes of noise. Hypothetically speaking, of course. This doesn't feel hypothetical. So what do you say? Gotta throw in the towel and throw away your pins? Oh god, he's crazy. <laughs> We'll keep them for now. Their suspicious faces make me happy. Yeah, <laughs> out of boy. I knew you'd make the right choice, kid. Never thought <laughs> I would meet someone so thoroughly loathsome. Guess we gotta tough it out the whole week. Well, I'm sure you know you've gotta do better than just tough it out. Unless you want to get stuck playing the game forever. That is forever. Since when was that part of the deal? There's no deal, kid. Life ain't fair and the afterlife sure as hell ain't either. Amen. You just gotta suck it up and play the game. You kids are playing the game, ain't ya? Well, you see. Oh, I see, alright. I see everything. Gulp. But hey, you do what you gotta do to get ahead, am I right? Can't fault you for that. Wait, seriously? Of course, as long as you're trying to earn points, who am I to judge? Let's just hope you earn enough before it's too late. <laughs> yeah, heh. I don't like him. He's one of the, the Reapers, so he's technically in charge of whatever we're doing. We got Snorty's approval. His name is Snorty now. I mean, I see it. I do. He is a creepy guy. I'm not talking to you. Chris warned someone was watching us. They're always being watched. Alright, let's get some food. Hello? You do well to choose a dining establishment. Yes, we're hungry. I'd like to go in. Oh, this food is expensive. I can afford to feed two of you, maybe. Not yet three. I may have to. I may have to fight a thing. Let's see if the food next door is cheaper. What? The sticker isn't it Ryoji's? Ah, oh, shoot! I didn't mean to click on that. I just wanted to go into the store. Got his insignia on it. Look, there's a barcode. Mm. Try scanning it with your phone. And I want a beef bowl. I mean, isn't that rather late, Grim? What is this now? A puzzle. One of these things is not like the others. One of these things just doesn't belong here. Which one's the odd one out? Oh, I have to select right now? Okay. Um. The triangle? There's not even like a hint. I don't. I mean, one, two, three, four, five. 
eight, nine. Like, there's no rhyme or reason to it. There's two circles, two squares, two of these. It has to be this one. There's just one triangle. Oh, oh. I got it. The triangle's the only one without a match. Ha! Shall I enter our answer? Yay! That was just a guess. I mean, I wonder what would have happened if I'd selected wrong. Hey, looks like we got it. One of the digits is number. Noted for future reference. <laughs> I sure am glad you're able to keep tabs on everything, boss. Let's see. Alrighty then. Yeah, I just wanted to go to the restaurant, guys. Calm down. Yes, sir. Haha, cheap food. Uh, so as you can see here, as HP and attack. This one's HP and attack. This one's HP, attack, and defense. And when you give it to the actual character, you can see their response to it. So both of them are pretty happy about it. She, not so much. I might give her something else. Uh, wow. Okay, she likes that. And he doesn't care. Oh, well, I'm broke, so. <laughs> Can't really feed you, dude. How about that? Nope, just broke. Okay. How do I cancel? There we go. You know, these young kids gotta eat. All customers must order one. I God damn it! Alright, I'm gonna. I'm gonna fight something real quick. Just real quick. Round them up. That's why my level is so high. I've been trying to get money. And it's been a struggle. Because like I said, they don't drop money, they drop pins that equal money, so just gotta pile up as many fights as I can get. What? It's a shark! It's a land shark. Oh, I forgot, what's my new power? And it dives. Oh shit. That's no fun. Alright, well, I'm gonna fight the ones in the air then. Since you're gonna be like that. It takes a while for it to. the chain to come up. There we go. Land shark! I forgot! That's why I stopped using that, that firepower. It's a stupid bomb. So you have to lay it down and hope that the thing walks where you lay it. Which is an unfortunate business model. Hello, shark? Gonna come out of there? Just gonna... Just gonna... Oh, it still hits him! Well, that's neat. Sounds necessary. Yeah, see, his takes a while to charge. I'm gonna lay these here and wait for it to come closer to me. Ah! There we go. Okay, those are annoying. And then sometimes, depending on what buttons you're currently using, because I switch them out pretty frequently just for the sake of mastering them. So sometimes I'll end up with weird combinations where it's like a series of charges, so it's really inconvenient for me as far as like getting a quick hit out. But you know, you just gotta plan accordingly. Or as much as you can. Yeah, the shark thing, and I don't have like any power that'll knock him out of there, unfortunately. And there we go. That's what we call a wombo combo. Okay, so R1 hits the but you gotta charge it first. Right, one more fight. I've been paying attention. I think I had a lot of draw. These sharks, they're new. They're new and they're annoying. Not a fan. Get the birds first. Not that that hits me, but. I see that's inconvenient. There we go. Okay. Now well, we just got the shark. That's over there. Oh, it's fixed. Oh, well, probably stuff I already have. Just gonna... Yeah, see, the. What's on my L1 now is that weird um, chain. 
so yeah, you can charge it up and then latch it on to the enemy, but for the most part, it'll probably be better against things that are not in the, in the ground like this. Oh, come on. Oh. Yeah, this was not a good combination for this enemy. So, so, yeah. Wow, shark bait, first of all, Nico. I just gotta keep him here so they're like, no. Oh, kill him with punches, that's fine too. Oh, I'm not gonna get a very good rating for that one. Look at her little kitty hands. Oh, thanks. That's better than I thought. A oh, new button. Cold Coney to Glacial Getaway. Oh yeah. Oh, I do have that one already. Pretty sure. That looks familiar. But yeah, Stylish Beam. That's new. I got 300 yen. Ooh. Alright, I think I can sell buttons here. Bijan? I know Bijan, I Asian. Teehee. Hold on, I've gotta go to a clothes store. Go up here in the shepherd's house where it's fancy. Hello! Some bees. I have just enough to eat, yay! And, um. Hmm. I'm gonna get a lot of extras. Alright, still, should be enough to eat. No one goes hungry in my house! Noodles, not that one. She's like coffee turvy. Ah, uh, really? I'm 20 off. Okay, one of you guys are gonna be hungry. Or less satisfied than the other. That's how this is gonna go, because they all have to eat and I'm very poor. Okay, so after you've chosen your meal successfully, they'll... They'll react to it. And sometimes it'll say, you got extra because so-and-so liked this dish, so it's, it's worth seeing who likes what. I'm gonna go do this again, AG. I totally didn't. I was just like, oh, he's standing here. Cool, I recognize him. Was he on this street? No, he was back here. Gonna go over to... I'm actually not sure. Tipsy Toes Hall. Oh, that's catchy. Just on Center Street. You should be yeah, there he is. memories of soup. I remember most of the ingredient, but something's still missing. What could it be? Think self. Think about how eating it made you feel. What a weird guy. Um uh, Aren't you guys even a little bit curious about this? I mean, this is the prince we're talking about. He's like the foodie king. Fret, by the way, has a total guy crush on him, Grim. I I, I ship it. <laughs> a prince and a king all at once. If he's this obsessed with some soup, it's gotta be amazing. <laughs> I'm gonna try jogging his memory. You sure that's a good idea? It can't hurt, right? Come on, dude, it'll be fun. Will it though? <laughs> I won't stop you, I guess. Rindo's not a very good leader. He's just like, eh, sure. I just have to imagine this totally rad, rad ramen. Just like the kind Sebastian used to make. Whatever that means. All right, so, uh, I knew it, but oh, the man crush on on this really pretty boy. Yeah, it happens. Um, what was I saying? Right. So, Fret's ability is to jog someone's memory. Now, it looks like a child drew it, and you just have to kind of uh, shift the. It's a lot harder than like Shelob's puzzle, Grim. If you recall from when I was playing the what to call it the other day. What was I playing? Shadow of War. I just lost it. Shadow of War. So you just gotta kind of finagle them until it makes the full picture. And I'm terrible at it because... There we go. You just have to be very careful. And again, it looks like it was doodled by a child. So I'm gonna guess he actually creates these memories. So now we've jogged his memory and it says... No matter how many times I have this soup, I'm never tired of it. it truly is perfect. 
The broth uses a whole chicken as well as a hint of pork bone. Sardines and seaweed add some depth, but the real stars love the chef pours into every bowl. I think I may never enjoy that incredible ramen again. It's like my life has lost meaning. Oh, I didn't see the rest of this. The broth was like Sebastian. Okay, well, I jogged his memory. What's this? It's as if a fog and shrouding my memories has begun to lift. Seaweed and sardines in the broth add depth of flavor, but most importantly, love. That's what I was missing. Of course the soup wouldn't taste right without love. <laughs> Forgive me, Sebastian. It seems I forgot the most crucial ingredient of them all. <laughs> what is happening? Damn, that's some real passion for food right there. I wish he had that passion for me, says Fret. I thought his whole shtick was dis passion. Indeed, though one must admit the uncharacteristic enthusiasm yeah. is enduring. You know, I feel like I did something good just now. And I want to do more. Who else needs help? Fret to the rescue! Random actor kindness are gonna have to wait. We've got a mission to complete. Right you are, my guy. Oh hey, cash! Worth. Oh, and friendship points. Sweet. Alright, let's see what he has to offer me in terms of... Damn, he needs five. Shibu pay auto load. Automatically confirms money pins and adds them to your Shibu pay balance. Oh, that's useful. I want that. I do not have enough money. Okay, I have six friend points left. I haven't had a game over yet, so I don't need that necessarily. I don't need easier difficulty. There's a shopkeep, so I have to add special items to the restaurant menu. Uh, sure. It's a trophy for eating everything, so might as well, right? Who's this? And why can't I get to them? What? 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 There. Uh, buy three items. I have not done that yet. Jun Sanobe. I'll do that in a minute. Yeah, most of these are shopkeeps. You just have to patronize their store. By the way, this is the barbecue master. He, um, a very muscular master Roshi, basically. Alright, that's all the points I have thus far. Um, so I did that. Someone else could use your help in Doganzaka and near Shibuya Hikari. I'm pretty sure I can get- oh, not that. Pretty sure I can reach there. Although, as you can see, they, they lock you off most of the time to kind of keep you on track. And to get to the other areas, usually they're tied into the story and you have to solve a puzzle to get past the sketchy gatekeeper. So this lock down here, should be a guy standing there and he's gonna ask me for something very specific. Yep, there he is. Oh. You kids seem pretty chill today. Are you even taking this game seriously? It seems like an oxymoron. Dead, seriously. Get it? Oh, fret. <laughs> right. And anyway, if you want to pass through here, you've got to win a three reduction chain battle at Center Street. Got it? And hop to it. Oh. Objective met. You kids get a gold star. Oh, cool. So they are retroactive. I was just about to say, they're not retroactive. Gotta go buy the battle things. Hey, money! I have money! What a wonderful feeling. Okay, so I can go back to Scramble Crossing now. Let's see if I can actually reach Hikari. I think it's down to the south of this. Well, if it isn't Rindy and Fret, this is this is one of the opponent or enemy teams, and of course, Rindo is not Rindo. Fret is head over heels for actually Grim, so I'm like disappointed. Shipping, yeah. Oh, hey, Cannon. Hey. Say, would you be a peach and move a sec? You're standing between me and my next clue. Oh, uh, my bad. What are you up to anyway? Playing hooky again? Uh, not exactly. I mean, I guess you could sort of see it that way. Has that Ryoji roped you into one of its sleazy little schemes? What? Th no, honest! How did you know about Ryoji? Way to give it up, bro! Cause you're acting pretty suspiciously for a couple of movies. You aren't trying to cheat, are you? Look not at me. Okay. You must be Rindy's latest recruit. That's Nagi. Pleased to meet you, Nagi! You've really been making a name for yourself with those crazy powers of yours. Sh she mm -hmm. has? Of course, diving into people's mind and raiding their privacy is pretty scandalous. Sounds a lot worse when you put it that way. 
To be fair, I definitely felt invaded. <laughs> Too bad I didn't make you a bear beauty while I had the chance. Wait, really? Well, sure, a powerful psych user like her is awful hard to come by. So you're saying you want someone like her on your team? Are you saying that you don't? Rindu here is just afraid of change, that's all. It took some cajoling, but I finally got him to see the potential I saw in old boss here. My my, it sounds like you've got an eye for talent. Not just one, I've got two! Oh, fret. Anyway, it seems like you don't want to tell me today's secret plan, so I won't push it. But if anything happens to my team, I'll be coming for you. Uh, coming to do what? To teach you boys a lesson. And here I thought you two were just a couple of innocent little cuties. Maybe I thought wrong. I mean, I think we're kind of cute. <laughs> Keep up that confidence. Ciao. Oh, fret. Is it just me or was Canon kind of terrifying? Do you think she's always like that? For our teammates' sake and our own. For her teammates' sake and our own, I hope not. Well, hey, look on the bright side. Having a rival is kind of motivating. <laughs> what blithe optimism. Heh. <laughs> oh, hang on a sec. Was that a chuckle I just heard? I most certainly was not. Maybe Fred's right. All the other players are our <laughs> rivals. Stop! I heard it with my own ears. Can you really keep up with the competition? Perhaps you ought to have, <laughs> Perhaps you ought to have your hearing checked. I like how Rindo's in his own little world while these two are talking. Lina! Oh, he's having a premonition. <laughs> Dead again? Well, you'll just have to change the feature. Why? Because he thinks they're cute? He was including himself in that. It's not like he was like, yeah, Rindo's the cutest of us all. You could be thinking that, I guess. Hello. Oh my, it's a justice burger. I guess that's the new Hi. item. I should patronize the stores that are going to give me benefits. This is... no, this is a bookstore. Boring. Alright, so I can go over here. Whatever he wants for me. Uh... Okay. What's up, Rindu? Nothing, it's just... It's just we're being stalked by a large shark-looking guy. Nico, you're hungry? Well, hurry up and come home! What's up, dude? Can you let us through? Sure thing, after you do what I say, of course. This is the start of a yow if ever I've seen one. My mission for you is... Take this dude! Oh god, another shark! <laughs> to defeat these noise. Good luck, a bunch of last place losers like you are gonna need it. Fight the noise! I'm gonna switch. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'll be here once you're done crying to your mommy. Well, I can't talk to my mommy, because we're dead! Anyway, um... Yeah, I'm gonna change. What was it? Piercing pillar? Mm. I don't really use this. I don't like the Great Magma Escape, but I have one more level for Natural Puppy, also ice. Before I master it, and that's really just my my thing. Because if you go over here to records, you can see which pins you've mastered. Uh huh. And so far, I have 28 out of 333. Oh, damn. Working on it, and there's also a ton of threads to collect, so I'm gonna need a lot of money. My point is, I'm gonna stick with it, even though I hate it, because I want to level it up. That's, that's just it. That's all I have going for me right now. I don't like this either. What else I got? Cherry Bomb? Kinesis. Oh yeah, it throws random items. I'll take that. Like, vehicular manslaughter is my favorite word. Nah. Or phrase for murder. It just sounds like a good time. <laughs> Maybe not for the person being murdered, but, you know. <laughs> you throwing cars, that reminds me of, um, Crimson, whatever. Remember a game I was talking- oh, it's random items, okay. So not always cars. Darn. Uh, 
comes in next to whatever the sun you got the other day, Grim. You, you throw a lot of cards, actually, because, you know, Psycho can use this, you lifting shit up and that's how you fight. So that's a good time. You think it's really good. Did you get the soundtrack for this one? I did not. There wasn't a collector's edition, although maybe on the PSN there's the option for the for additional content. Oh, that's easy as hell. What were you saying, scrub? Boom, oh, alright. Please be mastered. I'm so over it. Damn, so close. But yeah, the music's fantastic. Like, I listen to this shit in my car. Huh, not bad for a bunch of news. Wall clear, head on through. Gee, thanks. Thunder and lightning. Summon bolts of lightning to strike the target and surround enemies. Huh. Okay. Power records. That's not where I need to go, but I don't think I can go anywhere else. Let's see. Not that way, this way. Yeah, there's, there's no way. Let's see if there's anything I can interact with before I go over there. Not just these random people in the random fox. I got time for that. Nope. Alright, we'll head this way. I actually don't think I've come through here. Power Records? I think I have. It looks like it's locked off too. Still being stalked. Well, I guess I should be looking for this guy's stuff. Maybe I'll be able to do the other missions later. That's why there's still question marks. I'm hoping that's the way this is gonna go. No, work. no music, no life. Okay, so here's his other mark. Found a barcode. And it says... Eto. Scan it, dude. What's it say? Uh, it says something, alright. Tis surprisingly simple. It's a no-brainer. We all know the answer, or at least we should. Here goes. What's the name of the handyman you're trying? Really? Hmm. So so. Our hard-earned clue is one of the digits of seven. It would have been unspeakably embarrassing to forget his Disney. name of all things. Yeah, it'd be pretty awkward if he found out. Man, we're so good at finding clues. We should be detectives or something. Yeah, about that. Actually, what can I buy here? Music? I can. Well, you're spending a lot of time in here. This is the one I currently listening to. That's a fight song. Never look back. These intense acoustic beats will carry you forward into a shining new era. Breaking free. I like this one. Okay, now, can I choose my music? Is that, is that a thing? I don't know, I haven't been given the option, but then this is the first time I'm here, so yeah. Let's buy something just for the sake of giggles. Unconscious. I'm really loving these character designs. Disturbance. Apprehension, fear, dread. Your hair stands on end as you listen to this capriccio of horrors to come. Death throws? This is really mellow. I do like it. Peaceful day. Act the Fool. I like this one too. Okay, so can I choose them? Like what, what would that be under? Music? No. Damn! It's just a, collect a collection thing where it's completing a... Well, that makes me sad. Just a bit. I guess I'll hear them later. Or maybe it adds it to the rotation? I guess I'll run around for- Yeah, this is different, right? I believe this is one of the tracks I just bought. So that's good. It just adds it to the rotation. Because it had started to get a little stale with that single- single thing, but defense. What if I get you all smoothies? Do I have enough for that? He doesn't like it. He- I feel like threatens anything. That's not a comment on his sexuality, Grim. Uh, 
And Fred just eats anything and is happy with it. Would you like an acai smoothie? No, I do not have about that either. You are going to bankrupt me. And then over there you can see fullness. They just can't eat again because you can't just... You can't just spam food and raise all their stats for funsies. You have to actually give it time in between. So they just did that. So they are not just... Like I said, spamming stat changes. Alright, where else do I need to go? I'm totally losing track of what I'm doing. I like how it's one of the digits. It doesn't tell you, like, the order of them either. Okay. Look for a hole in the crossing, dog's backside, a haven covered in green. Well, this is green. Okay, so there should be something here. With exclamation point. I gotta look for his little insignia. I mean, this is really the only green I've seen. But I don't see a mark. Huh. Unless there's like a park? Yeah, it usually has the double exclamation points. Well, I found one here. I don't know if it's one per area, but... I'm gonna pay attention now, I promise. Not just walk around and go shopping in Shibuya. Which honestly, if I had any chance to go to Japan, I would spend all my time on the streets. I'm just saying. I don't know how I'd fly back. Like, I, I would not be able to afford it. I would just have to buy, like, separate... Not even like a carry-on, I'd have to buy a separate ticket for all the shit next to me. Alright, it said a hole in the crossing, this is Scramble Crossing, so it should be at the center, yeah? I don't know if this will help see better. And then the dog's backside, there's a dog statue over here. And those streets would be clean as fuck too. Dog butt! There it is. Lord Rindo. These appear to be, quite literally, a sign from Ryoshi. Sure does. It's like some kind of quiz. Ryoshi sure got a lot of time on his hands for a guy who's in trouble or whatever. Okay, the question is, which of the following isn't on the menu at Hachiko Cafe? Easy peasy, just look it up. The menu isn't on their site. Seriously? Ugh. Okay then, which one is it? I don't know. I haven't gone to Hachiko. Um, ice cream float? That sounds kind of weird. Did they have ice cream floats? Perhaps. Or perhaps not. I can't remember. My mind's totally blank. Surprise, surprise. I <laughs> if you could find the answers somewhere. Oh, okay, so... Uh, nope. It doesn't penalize you. I figured maybe they'd like change up the question or something. That way you're not just, you know, running to it and coming back. So, that should be... Yeah, cafe right here. Uh, I could go inside. Yeah, I haven't gone to this one, so I wouldn't know the answer. Um, yes, there's ice cream float and ice cold brew, which were two of them, so it was whatever wasn't that. Ice cream float, ice cold brew. Ice cream float, ice Oh, damn, damn it. Thank you, Grim. Mm. I don't think they serve milk tea. Well, I'm not wholly certain. I believe that's correct. Oh, yeah, I just remembered. I tried to order that once and they told me they didn't have it. Should have used a reminder power of yours on yourself. Right? You'd think he'd have great memory since he can do that. Come on, that would never work. Unless. Anyway, I'm putting this down as our answer. And the result? You, we got it. It says one of the digits is nine. Beautiful. Good work, team. Hmm. I don't know about team. Alright, so hole in the crossing. I would assume it would be in the middle of this area. Crossing is literally all the crosswalks. But I don't see our double exclamation points. My memory is going, Grim. Going, going, gone. Not seeing any exclamation points. And I highly doubt it's going to be one per area. Sort of the simple fact of the matter is I can't get to every place currently. One of them said back alley. Oh, I can go to Shibuya Hikari. Okay. Wasn't sure. Because there's a mission out this way. If I recall correctly. 
should be someone to talk to. Ah, damn it. Wrong direction. Switched up the angle on me. A lot more mellow than what was playing before. Okay, going this way. There we go. Should be. Oh, hey, a piggy! These fights are limited time and they give you money. Kind of like a, a metal cactuar in Final Fantasy or. A, I really can't think of another enemy that the whole purpose is just to give you money, but. You know. And they're cute! And the music changes. So there's that. I mean, you have to be They're also not very strong. After. I'm just letting you enjoy the music for a moment. So they're worth pursuing when you see them. Catchy! Anywho, um, I can change her pen. She's mastered that. I've got Stylish Beam... Oh, Thunder and Lightning. That sounds like fun. Yeah, he has nothing available to him. There are... I mean, there's no classes, but the... Pins are locked to what characters can use them, unfortunately. So sometimes you'll run into... Ah, here's the side mission. So sometimes you'll run into a situation where you won't have any new buttons for a while for one character. Um, even though he's already mastered, he or she has already mastered what they've had for a long time. So that's unfortunate, but what can you do? This is one of the best one too. I want to listen to this one. How do I get it to stay? It's been playing this one. Yeah, it has. Okay. I don't know. Say, I know you three. You're players, aren't you? Huh? Uh, yeah, but what's it to you? You're a reaper or something? Alrighty, then it's time for a quiz. Ignore the question. Listen, we're kind of in a hurry. And your timer starts now! <laughs> are you even listening, buddy? I know not who you are, yet I loathe to walk away from a fight. <laughs> See, the little lady gets it. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hang on, Nagi. I don't think we have time for this. Lord Window, please. We cannot very well turn down a challenge such as this. <laughs> My honor is a one-time Quiz Academy Queen quizzer is at stake. Uh, okay. News to me. Quiz Academy? <laughs> Looks like it's some kind of arcade game. The title of Queen Quizster is awarded to any player that tops the leaderboard for 10 weeks running. Oh. Meh, what have we got to lose? I say we take him on. Fine. Augie doesn't look like she's gonna back down anyway. Shall not let you down, Lord Rindo. Okay, what's this quiz? Let me save! Before I completely botch this. This is just general knowledge. Ready for your quiz? Sure. Alright, time for the first question. Which of the following products is a palindrome? Oh. That's one of those things that reads the same forward and backward, right? Correct. Think you can handle this, Nagi? <laughs> you needn't be worried. I like how she has the, the creepy Yandere laugh. The k k k Uh... What? Please hold while I consult later and did not even try to do that in my head. I like how he says the timer starts, but there's no timer. 1944? Incorrect. Alright, 12 times 21... 252. There we go. <laughs> Far too easy. Yeah, okay. Alrighty. Next question. What breed of dog with a... It's a Shiba, right? <laughs> Okie dokie, time for the last question. What soared through the skies above Hachiko in 1951? Uh, I would assume a cable car- what? There's no way it's the other two things unless we're talking about like the, the dead world, right? right? <laughs> you sure about that? Heh, fine. Uh oh, you're gonna struggle to win if you keep answering like that. What? 
I don't... What? Oh. <laughs> <Huh>. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was a Shiba. It might have been a Nikita. Should I switch this one or the next answer? I'm like a hundred percent sure. I guess the next one's outlandish? Oh, it was a Nikita? Damn it, Nico! So then, this made sense? The cable car? What is a Pegasus? <laughs> Alright, I'll try it one more time. Ugh. I like how they give you all the chances in the world anyway, so it doesn't matter if you answer correctly. Well, of course it's a cable car, the other thing isn't a thing. Your pathetic questions insult me. Uh-huh. <laughs> Damn it. You win, okay? <laughs> My quiz was clearly no match for you. Heh. Indeed. Well, if you wish to have another round sometime, I'll have more quizzes at the ready. Challenge accepted. <laughs> Excellent! But where these questions will be doubtless more difficult than any you've ever answered. Okay, guy. In any case, your performance today was most impressive. Why, you've inspired me to cover even more unknowable trivia. That wasn't really unknowable! <laughs> well, that was a most pleasant diversion. Let's return to more important yeah! matters. Dang, boss, you smoked that guy! Fret's right, she sure knows her stuff. Let's ignore the first two flubs, shall we? Okay, I got a thousand yen. Um, friendship points. Of course it might work. What is he good for? Uh, false. Oh, I was already on it. He is five points. Add an auto style option to the threads menu. Oh, so auto equip. I mean, I don't change equipment that often, but uh, sure. I mean, I've got nothing else to spend the points on. Why not? I'll just buy hers and his too. Oh, I didn't see that. Display an HP ga gauge of the currently targeted enemy. Now that's useful. What is this? Kyoto Sweets. <clears throat> oh, there's two stores. Okay. So I can get close to yes, here. Right awesome. What was I missing? That's a hat. I was missing a... a an accessory for her, which I do not have currently. Alright, were there any images here? I might as well try to fight to see if I can get any new pins. I'd like to try it at least once per area. Just to see. <laughs> these sharks though, man. These sharks though. Not a fan. Oh, what about the lightning? Ooh, it hits multiple enemies. I, uh, I'm fucked with it. Not the shark, though. Shark sucks. Fuck you, you shark! Oh, I forgot I changed his. He's a better kick now. Kick that does not hit the shark. Alright. That's new electricity. That makes sense. I probably should have saved it then, but when it came out of the water, and drowned. Drowned. God, that's annoying. Would you? Wow! At least you can plant it, because it comes out of the thing. It indicates when it comes out, unfortunately. So if I just smack him a lot while he's out, then he's not gonna go back in. Yeah, that's how we're doing this. It's like a hazing, but not quite. Unfortunately, some of my attacks require a charge, so it's not really feasible to keep him out for a long period. Um, where the hell were you going? One more. I'm closest to leveling. These sharks. I do like the AoE on that attack. Just it's a good move. Not the shark, the bird. Or the frog, sure. As I say, not the shark, it comes right out of the ground. Okay. Now the shark. Good 
charge these up, wait for him to surface, and wha bam! Oh, I knocked him right out of range. Just, uh, just gotta juggle him. Just gotta keep him out of the ground. Uh, don't do it. Damn. Oh, come on, jerk. And of course you do significantly less damage when he's under the ground, too. Not a fun time. Now he's gone completely. Where are you? Yeah, lightning, bro. There he goes again. Final strike! What the? Hopefully got some money out of that. Beautiful. It's a shark, man. It's a shark. Uh, get much. Level up. Anywho, littles, I was um, I was here for a reason, wasn't I? Is there another clue here? I got the side mission. I've got one more of those in Dogenzaka. If I can even reach there. Otherwise, um, let's see. Backstreet refreshments, hole in the crossing, haven covered in green. I'm telling you, the haven covered in green has to be the area I was just at, although I didn't see anything. Just gotta very carefully look about. Yeah, what you're seeing here is pretty much the main gameplay loop. You have a mission for that day, sometimes side missions, you complete them, and then it moves on to the next day. Um, game's got a total of seven days and they're split up over several hours because of course within those within those main missions are these little side missions and whatnot that you actually have to get done. And as you unlock more party members, you have more psyches, so we have um, Nagi's ability to dive into people's brains, which is frightening thoughts, but hey. Uh, you have um, Fret's ability to remind people of things. You have Rindo's ability to to rewind time, actually. I haven't got a chance to use that on camera as of yet, but suffice to say, it's a multi-step thing. I'm not trying to fight, I'm just trying to look, okay? It has to be here, a hole in the crossing. Yes, this should be scramble crossing. But what is it referring to as far as a hole? I don't see any floating... And then I was thinking maybe it's a person, but... No one is red, which is usually what it is when... It's significant to the story. And of course I already found the dog thing. I can just scan some random people. Just trying to throw these off. <laughs> Cute. Yeah, nothing. Hmm. What am I not seeing? Oh, this one. Oh, maybe I can get to Dogen Zaka. Bella. Yeah, okay. There's some places here. Oh, there's a lot of enemies. Okay, well, we're gonna keep that off. I'm not looking for any more sharks in my life right now. Any... I can go up here. If there's a shop. There was also a pig last time, but I think that's a one-time thing. Okay, so this goes where now? Sutaya East. Sometimes these random thoughts are pretty funny. Can I? Oh, that's not a path. Got to look at the mini map. So, Dogenzaka, haha. Okay, I can at least do the side mission here. Oh, point up there too. All right, looking for an individual with that little wiggle above its head. Looks like I can go from other places from here too. Hold up, I smell something. What is it? 
doth my nose deceive me? Or is that the succulent, spicy scent of curry? You don't miss a thing when it comes to food. <laughs> Damn right. Ooh, ooh. Perhaps the shop over there is the source, although tis not yet in business by the looks of it. I think it's set to open up soon. They've been saying that since the very beginning of this game, by the way. I'd rather trying out some crazy, awesome new recipe in there. Let's take a peek. Prep, don't. Tis improper to peer into restaurants before com preparations are complete. Yeah, you're gonna have to wait. Oh, wait, no, the mission's here. Cool. Uh, how do I actually... Oh, there we go. Mm. Oh, looks like we gotta purge him of his sins. This is all wrong. This isn't the curry I wanted to make. What am I supposed to do? It's almost a grand opening. This guy's important. He actually has a face. I don't have time to revise the recipe, but I can't go around dishing up mediocre curry oh. either. It's hopeless. I'm gonna fail. Curry, curry, curry. What is curry anyway? I've been thinking about it so much I've lost what it means. What do I do? Oh. Dang, he's really getting himself down on him. Or getting him down on himself this about is, this. Uh... Indeed, he seems to be suffering from culinary artist's block. Sounds bad. Oh, but what if it's not just him worrying? Maybe it's like this because a noise got to him. Good thinking. That's gotta be it. Bullseye. Who? Uh? Hey, aren't you one of those Deep River Society guys? They're a rival team. I am, but that's not important right now. You sure about that? Uh. Yeah, they were one of the few people that I fought rather than these weird noise monsters. Yes, what is important is that I really love ramen. The Don's ramen, to be precise. Huh? But he's not making cur but he's making curry, not ramen. Now that you mention it, I think I remember there being a ramen shop here before. Yeah, this is where Don used to serve up the absolute best ramen about three years ago. But one day he wound up getting real sick. Noodle overdose, they said. I'm sorry, is that a thing? He had no choice but to close up his beloved shop. Jeez, that is tragic. <sighs> One must be wary of malnutrition. After that, he got really into Indian traditional medicine for some reason. Went all the way to India to study it. That's where he had real curry for the first time. Totally changed him. The Don's the Don. Devoted all his time to curry since. It's like all that passion he had for ramen just switched targets. So of course he decided to open up his own curry shop. Which is all well and good. Or at least it would be if he'd snap out of that funky then. But the noise has a real chokehold on him. It's got his train of thought running in circles. I don't want to bring him out as funk, but I feel powerless. That's why I need your help. I know our teams aren't on the best of terms, but you gotta help me get the Don back on his feet. Please, I need to try his curve. You know, man. Wow. Well, don't know about you guys, but I'm in. I know well the torture of anticipating a new release. It's <laughs> such, despite my reluctance to delve into such a troubled mind, I agree to lend a helping hand. Can I even call this curry, or is it just cultural appropriation? Oh, What's still going on? To seem there's no time to waste. Ahem, pardon the intrusion. Or do you intrude upon his brain? Darn, I wanted to save. It wasn't fast enough last time, that bothers me. It still bothers me. This is, this is like a full hour later. Oh, it changed to the other track I bought. It's very quiet. Love it! Oh, I think it makes it easier when you can actually see what you're expecting in terms of in terms of health, and it also makes it harder because we've got these big ass bears that can take a hit. Level up! Really to fight to. Alright, how many waves we got? That's one. Oh, what was it? Huh, I was expecting it to be like the first one. Okay. Easy peasy. Who would have thought the tutorial mm -hmm. fight would be harder than this? Huh? What am I getting so worked up about? There's no use trying to change my roots. I was born and raised here in Shibuya. It's part of mm -hmm. who I am. I love authentic Indian curry, but anything I make is gonna have a little bit of me in it. I should embrace that. Embrace it and run with it. Full speed ahead! Shibuya hasn't seen the last of my ramen yet. I'll take what I already know and spice it up curry style. Time to get cooking. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, well, I'd say so. <laughs> Indeed, I dare say the matter is resolved. Nagi, why do you look so creepy? You did great, Nagi! Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you! 
I'm gonna get to try the Dawn's Curry and it's all thanks to you. Which means now you owe us one. Oh, I don't know about that. It's not like he's opening the store just for me. I call this a win for both of us. Stop by once it opens. One bowl should be a reward enough for your efforts. I'll put in a request to get this place a Reaper sticker. It's gonna be incredible. Can't wait, but I guess I have to. Well, see you around. <coughs> Hang on, you can't just go. Oh, but he did. Why do I feel like we just got used? Pay it no mind. <laughs> Besides, I'm rather eager to savor this curry myself. If you're okay with it, then I guess it's fine. Come back tomorrow to see if it's open. Well, since you're telling me it's tomorrow, it's definitely gonna be open. Huh? Oh, well, it added him to my social network, so that's something. Right? What does he have to offer me? Reduces the amount your maximum HP decreases when you lower your level. Lower my level. Now, why would I do that? I'm gonna wait on that one. Okay, so, is there anything... Anything here? And why do I need Roji's direct line? Can't I just, I don't know, find him on the street? Oh, these all go to O East. Alright, this is an alleyway. It says something about a back alley, but I'm not sure if it's this one per se. I'm just looking for that sticker. Anything up here? Oops. Let's go over. Hi ho. It's off to work I go. And now I miss the stairs completely. Yeah, I don't see it. Okay, let's head to OE's then. Ah, uh, so poor. I'm sure there'll be better ways to earn money later on, but for now it's a struggle. Anything over here? Just this shop? Oh! He's cute! Hey there, Tigre Punks! Wait, is he... <laughs> Excuse me. Is he one of the... Social, social, social links? Let's see, what stores do I need to buy from? I don't remember his face, but it's entirely possible. He had red... Oh yeah, he is! Okay. Reach VIP 3. Mm. It's an item reward, a red mohawk set. And of course, to reach a VIP level, you can see down at the bottom, you have to spend money with these guys. What is this? Heavy Slugger. I already have this. Spiked wristband. I'm broke. I'm definitely a cutie. I know! Great thing about punks, how it bothers little bits from all kinds of culture. That's nice, dear. These boots are hot. Earthbound. Prevents knockback when hit by enemy attacks. Ooh! Poison resistance, attack boost. So yeah, they do have useful stats. I'm just... <sighs> I'm just so poor. So, so, so poor. Okay, so I do have... I already mastered Glacial Getaway. Why did I have it equipped? It is pretty easy to lose track of what you need to level up. That's why I tend to sell off any doubles. Okay. But I don't know, I have this thing where I'm like, I've already mastered this, it's a waste of time to continue using it. It's, it is what it is. I'm gonna get these boots. And... I don't know, what do I need on Minamimoto? Should have everything equipped. Just an accessory. Okay, so I need shoes for Fret though. All my shoes are taken up, so let's get shoes. Which do, yeah, the knockback prevention. Actually, this is an accessory. I don't get this. Can I get them both? Nope. Oh, so close. So good. I'll find Fred something else. I'll be alright. Leave this to you. Okay. This goes back to Dogensaka. There's another store on this strip. One of them? Kony Kony. That's another brand. Hmm. 
pins are nice. And then uh, some of them increase the power of stone affinity pins. Yeah. Some of the items. Well, the items are the same brand as the pins, so some of them boost your efficacy with said pins, as long as it's the same brand. So that's something to think about when you're equipping your characters. It doesn't always work out that way, but I mean, I'd rather bear stats over like, you do 10% more damage with this if you use this brand, and then lock myself to a single brand. Hmm. Alright, well, Nico's on her way, we're gonna go eat something, so Grim, I'll catch you next time. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Hope it informed you on this wonderful world we call 20. Mm. I will eventually find these other clues and carry on. Hopefully next time you see me I'll have my final party member in here. But we'll see, it all depends. Yeah, now I'm doing a lot of things and stuff and working again, so... <sighs> it is what it is. Stay in the know!